They're going up on YouTube. I watch my YouTube channel. Weirdo. Know. Watch my YouTube channel. And text text in the chat. Text in the chat. Alright. I'll show you to watch it too. Realistically, like it shows how tight the leaderboard is. If one bad game drops you four places on the leaderboard so far, and what that means is they need another big pop off. And this team, like when I envisage teams who are gonna get 10, 15, 20, or maybe 20, I don't want to get carried away. Eliminations, like I don't see it being this team. You know, I see these guys being the guys who are take hike, get a victory royale, five, six eliminations, even if they play low to mid, something similar to that. So it's harder for these kind of teams to catch up. Yeah, they've already picked up a victory royale in this tournament series um, but this again to get a little bit more wouldn't put them past the wouldn't put it past them to get another victory royale before this day is over so with a couple more runs in front of them we'll see how they end up playing out here this is a team that can navigate those very difficult zones like we watched in game head. number one yesterday when things went right off the side of that cliff they just knew how to play it they played it pretty well ended up getting themselves a nice win off of it on the side, the lowest an individual or, or lowest an eventual NA East champ has been after day one is second. Chapter two, wow. Five, and six. That's really impressive, actually. So, I mean, that kind of coincides obviously with what we got going on here with Muzz at the start of the day.
you guys hear me? Who's mocking stuff? My game just, I'm about to be done with this stupid game. This game needs 